Hi everyone, I Shurujit welcome you all on Econometrics Day channel. आज हम लोग सीखने वाले हैं क्लास सिक्स का मैथमेटिक्स तो चलिए बिना वक्त गवाए शुरू करते हैं आज का क्लास नाउ टूडे क्लास सिक्स स्टूडेंट्स वी आर अगेन गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू विथ चैप्टर टू प्लेइंग विथ नंबर एंड वी आर गोइंग टू कंटिन्यू विथ एक्सरसाइज टू पॉइंट वन एंड टूडे इज पार्ट इज पार्ट टू ओके सो लेट आस सॉल्व क्वेश्चन नंबर टू दिस वॉज वी आर गोइंग ऑन सॉल्विंग दिस सम ओनली वी डिड अप टू डी नाउ क्वेश्चन नंबर ई एटीन प्लस टेन माइनस सेवन इंटू थर्टी टू डिवाइडेड बाई वन बाई थ्री ऑफ ट्वेंटी फोर now here what must rule we have to follow so bracket is not there after that off so off is here so we will do this part first so what i will write 18 plus 10 minus 7 into 32 divided by now this one we can cut off means into i told you so 3 ones are and 3 eights are 24 so 1 into 8 it is 8 only now after that off done Now what is there? Now D for division. So this is division. We will do 18 plus 10 minus 7 into now 32 divided by 8. So 32 divided by 8. 8 how much is 32? 8 fours. So what we will write? Four. Clear or no? Now after that 18, you can see here. Here multiplication is there. So let us do the multiplication first. Okay, 7 fours are 28. Now after multiplication. comes what addition so 18 plus 10 28 minus 28 equal to 0 and this is the answer clear now question number f so f bracket is not there so off is there so we will do this one so 9 of 12 that means off means what multiply so we will multiply 9 to the 18 1 carry 9 ones are 9 Plus one ten hundred and eight. Clear no? Then minus sixteen plus thirty two into two. Now after this we will multiply. Okay, because of done now division is not there. After that multiplication. So one zero eight minus sixteen plus. So this two I can multiply. So two two is a four. Two three is a six. Now after that we have to do what after multiplication addition. So this one and this one I can add. One zero eight and sixty four. So eight plus four twelve one carry six plus one seven one. So what you get one seventy two minus sixteen. Now we have to subtract. So if I subtract sixteen, okay, two and six. Can you subtract? No, you have to borrow. So you have to cut this seven, make it six, and this becomes twelve. Twelve minus six six. Six minus one five, and then one comes. So one fifty six. And this is the answer. Clear. Now, class six students, let us solve question number two G. So this is the sum. So we will see bracket. Bracket is not there. After that, off. So off. We can see here. So this part I will solve first. One by six of fifty-four. So what I will write? Forty-two divided by seven into six plus. Now one by six of fifty-four. So we can cut six ones are six, six nines are fifty-four. So one off means into one into nine is what? Nine into five. Clear. Now after that off. Now D means division. So forty-two divided by seven. Seven how much are forty-two? Six are. So six into three plus nine into five. Now after that multiplication. So six into three, eighteen plus nine into five, forty-five. Now we will simply add this one. If you can add directly, you can add it. Five plus eight, thirteen. One carry. One plus one, two plus four, six, sixty-three. And this is the answer. Or you can do here one rough work. Eighteen, forty-five. And what you will do? Eight plus five, thirteen. One. One plus one, two plus four. Six sixty-three. So like this, you can do it. Okay. Now let us come to question number eight. So this is the sum, but here you can see bracket is there. 
so we will do the bracket portion and in the bracket portion also i have told you how to do it first line bracket then what line bracket is here line bracket is not here then round bracket then curly and then box so we will do the round bracket first okay that means this curved portion okay minus now 19 minus now i'll open the bracket 14 minus 8 how much 6 then minus 4 then i will close it again curly bracket and then the box bracket now after that 42 minus now 20 then minus then curly bracket 19 minus now 6 minus 4 you know nicely 2 so we will put the curly bracket and the box bracket no need to write now the round bracket okay now after that 42 minus then box bracket then 20 minus now 19 minus 2 is how much 17 so we will write 17 and then we will put the box bracket no more the curly bracket now after that 42 minus now 20 minus 17 is how much 3 and no more the box bracket now 42 minus 3 is how much 39 and this is the answer if you cannot do you can do it in rough 42 minus 3 you cannot you to borrow cut this one so 12 so 12 minus 3 is 9 and then this 3 comes down so i hope you have understood question number 2 g and h g answer is 63 and h is 39 now students those who are new in my channel if you like this video if you like my channel then i would like to request all my students to please give a like share this video more and more with your friends classmates and relatives and don't forget to subscribe my channel because when you subscribe it really really motivates me to make more such interesting videos for you all and also don't forget to press the all notification bell ting ting so that whenever i upload such videos you will get the notifications first now we will move on to the next question now we are going to move on to question number i 2i so this is the sum so here you can see brackets are there so so many types of brackets are there box curly round so we will start with what round okay already in the first introduction part i told you first we have to see the line then the round bracket then curly and then box so here line bracket is not there then what is there round so we will do this part first so what i will write 910 minus then 80 plus and after that 34 minus now here 77 minus 50 how much comes 27 okay now after that 910 minus same thing you to write okay plus now 34 minus 27 how much comes 7 comes okay now 910 minus 80 plus 7 how much 87 and now we have to subtract so 910 and 87 if you subtract you cannot so you have to borrow and it becomes what 10 10 minus 7 is what 3 0 and 8 you cannot subtract it to borrow make it 8 and 10 10 minus 8 is what 2 and then 8 comes here so what you get 8 23 and this is the answer clear now question number j so j also bracket is there so bracket portion we will do first 54 plus 9 and then we are opening the bracket okay so 43 minus 26 so you have to subtract these two so 43 at 26 can you subtract no you have to borrow so it becomes 13 so 13 minus 6 is how much 7 and 3 minus 2 is what 1 so what you get 17 minus 2 so this part you did 43 minus 26 so 17 minus 2 then divided by 3 so bracket portion is not over we have to continue okay 54 plus 9 and then here nothing means into is there okay 9 and then bracket starts that means 9 into okay and then 17 minus 2 is how much 15 divided by 3 now after the bracket what comes division so this part we will do 15 divided by 3 
So 54 plus 9 into, now 3, how much is 15? 3, 5 is 15. Now after that 54 plus 9 into 5, 45. Now we will add it, 54 at 45, 99 and this is the answer. See, 54, 45, 9 and here also 9. So 99 is the answer. Clear. Now we are going to come to question number 2 key. So this is the sum, brackets are there. So we will start with the round bracket. Okay. Now here what? 5, 5, 5. Round means the curved portion. Okay. Plus, now curly bracket 22 plus 3, 43. Don't add this one first. Okay. Now minus, now this one comes. Okay. Now if you see nicely, Inside the bracket, what I told you to again follow odd mass. Okay. So here off is not there, then division. So division is there. 16 divided by 8. 8, how much are 16? 8, 2 is 16. Then plus 13 minus 15 as it is. Now after that, 555 plus then 22 plus 343 minus now 2 plus 13. How much? 15. Then minus, again 15, then bracket close and curly bracket. Now after that, 555 plus, now 22 plus 343 minus. Now 15 minus 15 is what? 0 only. And then we will put the curly bracket. Now after that, 555, okay, plus. Now 0 to no use. Now this one, 22 and 343 is how much? 343 and 22. So 5, here how much? 6 and here 3. So you get 365. Directly only you can do it. Okay, because minus 0, no use. So you got 365. Now simply we will add 365 and 555. Okay, 5 plus 5, 10, 1 carry. 6 plus 1, 7 plus 5, 12, 1 carry. So now 3, 4, 4 plus 5, 9. So what do you get? 9, 20. And this is the answer. So I hope you have understood question number K. Now it's your duty to practice all the sums which I taught today. Okay. Practice nicely and follow the Bodmas rule. Agar video acha lage, to video ko like, share or subscribe karna. मत भूलिएगा कुछ भी डाउट होगा तो आप लोग कमेंट सेक्शन में जाओ और आपका डाउट लिखो मैं कोशिश करूंगा कि सबको रिप्लाई करने का ठीक है मिलते हैं और एक अच्छे नए कंटेंट के साथ तब तक के लिए बाय बाय